Hi, my name is Jodie, Jodie Prenger, and I'm 26 years of age, and I'm from Blackpool, and I am a singing teacher, a singer, and I also do some office work. And I want to be the UK's next biggest loser because I am sick of being how I am, and I really want to beat this battle. Let's welcome back Jodie! Jodie, what a girl. Oh my god. Oh, that kind of Come on, get in. Come in, and Mark. <laughs> Talk about the new Blackpool illuminations. <laughs> <laughs> you are beautiful. Oh, Jodie, yeah. what was your real inspiration for losing so much weight, Jodie? Well, I, I just, I owe so much to my, my mum and my dad and my nan and my granddad, and I owe so much to you, Angie, and to everybody, me bro, everybody. I just want to thank you all so much because you've given me my life back. Thank Jenny, you. Well, it's time now. Let's just take a look at your amazing oh. story, OK? People do shout out, fat, and, and you've you got to smile and just laugh it off. And inside, it's just, it's just horrible. It really is horrible, sorry. From day one, Jodie seemed destined to stand out being the only girl on Angie's red team. She's a good girl. She's uh, full of banter. <laughs> I think she's going to be asset to the side. God! Maybe I've got lots of testosterone in me. Is it testosterone or testosterone? I don't know. I've never had it, so... <laughs> she's always the first up. Usually the last to bed, and there's a hell of a lot of training that goes in in between. Just think about Liz. Think about beating her. It's not an option to not beat her. Come on! Abs! Strong! Strong! The thing is, I've made some really great friends here that um, I know I will stay friends with forever and ever and ever. Jodie never ceases to amaze me. She's such a lovely girl. When I'm missing home and feeling low, fair play to Jodie. She's always there for me. And having lost an incredible four stone in the house, Jodie returns home to her astonished family and friends. I was gobsmacked. I couldn't believe it. I could not believe it. I still don't think I'd... I do believe it in a way. She just looks phenomenal. <laughs> Training outside the house is really, really hard, but I've got a secret weapon. Ex-Army tough man John Aberdeen has been thrashing Jodie into shape. Work. Nine. Work. Eight. Keep it going. Seven. One more. Okay. One more. Go on, go on. You know, days when I feel like, oh, I can't. You know, he's been there to push me further and further and, like, run that extra mile, which is just fantastic and exactly what I need, being on my own outside the house. Before, I couldn't even look in the mirror. But now I can look in the mirror and think, I quite like me. Nobody could buy the happiness that this has created for Jodie. No, nothing. No money on earth could buy it. I can't find words to say truly how happy she is. Your whole family so happy. Do, do you know what? It's just been my biggest miracle because it's just given me the world twice over. I'm just so happy. I really oh, am. Yes. Just, oh, I'm just so happy. <laughs> <laughs> Angie, what was the key, do you think, to Jodie's success? Immense courage, really. Immense courage. An amazing sense of humour, I think. <laughs> do you know what? I do. I think that's one of the things I got through. I mean, she held her own with the guys. 
which is not yeah. easy. She held her own with me, which is not easy. <laughs> You're going to inspire so many, not just women, but people. It's just, it's the most amazing feeling. And it's true, if it does inspire people, I hope it does. I mean, I look at your waist and when you walk in, so, it's unbelievable. <laughs> oh, wait till I breathe in, it's great. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jodie, go and join Lee and Ben. Oh. Jodie! <laughs> for you to go and get changed and get ready for your final weigh-in. Stay tuned to find out which of our finalists has won the ultimate battle of the bold. Will it be Ben, Jodie or Lee who's crowned the next UK's biggest loser? See you in a couple of minutes.